Hello traders and welcome to another video review. Today is Tuesday, August 15th, 2024. Let's find out what is going on on the Bitcoin quoted of course to Tether and we are looking at this at daily time chart on Zonda Crypto. What is going on uh, here? As you can see, uh, what we can see straight on at the first glance when we look at this chart is that the market has a problem with the level of 62,000. Now let's investigate further why there is a problem to break out higher above the level of uh, 62,000 tethers. Uh, we are going to use the um, Fibonacci and we are going to measure this last mm, swing. If we measure this uh, last swing, uh, we can clearly mm, we can clearly see uh, that. Let me just uh, place my. Uh, Fibonacci, we can clearly see that the level of uh, 60, uh, 2033 uh, tethers is the 61% of the Fibonacci retracement. Let me make it a little bit uh, clear uh, here on this on this chart. So we are going to get rid of all of this unnecessary for us uh, levels. And this is, of course, the situation where we are looking at the major ones and the most popular ones the most the strongest one all right let me just extend the line as well <clears throat> so we can see it on the right there you go 62,033 tethers 61 percent perfect retracement from this low here let me just place the technical support for this low so this low here of course 49,501 to the 61 percent Fibonacci retracement big 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 massive rally happened one day nevertheless then we still have inside bar inside bar inside bar inside bar inside bar of the big bar of course right so the movement to the upside doesn't actually looks impressive it's a typical movement where the bulls are trying to retrace as much as possible but then eventually it looks like the market wants to go lower so our current scenario for the situation on the Bitcoin to, to Tether is unfortunately uh, still bearish. We got the high, 69,812. We got the first wave down. We are going to label it as the wave A. 61% retracement is where the wave B had been completed, roughly. What is missing here? Yes, we are missing wave C to the downside. We are missing this wave here. Uh, that might be... <coughs> made uh, really really quickly the reason why we choose the abc correction is that it's very very popular it's a typical for the corrective wave especially wave b to retrace 38 50 or 61 percent right so this is the the last um possible level strong level of the fibonacci retracement that can engage more bears in our situation of course bears that will push the prices lower all right so this is the current scenario uh, for the uh, for, for the bitcoin it doesn't actually looks that that bullish it doesn't actually um uh, suggest that the movement to the downside had been completed uh, only a strong breakout above 61 percent fibonacci retracement which is 62033 tethers would invalidate the current scenario and put the swing high 69,812 up for a test otherwise we have to wait for this market to confirm our scenario uh, momentum wise if we stay below the level of 50 as you can see bulls are not strong enough to break above this level of course that's another um, clue the bears are ruled, uh, ruling the market right now. <clears throat> they are in charge of this market. They want this market to basically go lower. They allowed bulls to retrace on the 61%. Now they are ready to push the market uh, down again. So that's our scenario for the Bitcoin to Tether. Thank you very much for watching this analysis and I hope I see you guys next time. Take care and bye bye.